Hey guys, I just wanted to come on here really quickly to tell you that in the outro of this video, I will be explaining all 1001 excuses as to why I've not been uploading. Alright, cool. Welcome to the League of Legends. Turbo Guy. The guide that goes in-depth into a champion's asshole in under 60 seconds. Today we're going to be talking about Fizz, so let's get into it. Fizz grew up wanting to be a world-class Olympic pole vaulter, but then one day he woke up and Poseidon said, Let me use a fish! So he kicked Poseidon in the balls and stole his trident. And who are you to tell me that it happened any differently? It's not like anyone actually reads the lore. You got slippery like a squid, rusty fork, one day I'll slip and this will go up my ass, and as our lord and savior once said, it's not even a shark. Fizz doesn't actually have a passive, as demonstrated by McDonald's getting creep blocked. But that shit doesn't matter because it doesn't take away from the precious damage, and that is the key to Fizz. Damage. Defense is for scared little pussies, and pussies don't live in the ocean, therefore Fizz can't be one. Think of it this way, they can't kill you, if they're dead. They also can't kill you because two out of every six seconds is spent in bullshit town to top your pole. Now you're saying, but 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 for us, you built Azania's hourglass, isn't that a defensive item? I'm pretty sure if a panther could turn golden after slitting the throat of an antelope and watch it bleed to death, it would. And as a final tip for you fizz players out there, don't play fizz into me, or I may just pull out my AD Amumu and kick your ass. That's it. Toodles. <sighs> I got some explaining to do. I know, let's go through this quickly. If you want a more in-depth story, come out to my stream this weekend, link is below, any whore, calendar me. So the last day to release the video was October 30th. The following week I had a video ready, but then at the last moment all my OBS footage on my computer killed itself, which was lovely. That weekend I went to my old college to visit some friends, yay fun times. The next week I started on working on a new video, but it was a biggie, so it wasn't gonna be out anytime soon and I was fine with that. I worked slowly throughout the next week and a half, and then Summoner's Con was right around the corner. I realized that I couldn't finish the video and be healthy at Summoner's Con, so I postponed finishing it. I returned from Summoner's Con on Thanksgiving, brother is in town for the weekend, so I chill with him. Monday comes and it's back to the grind. I was a bit lazier than normal. Normal, and not going to lie, it was my fault there. I was 90% done with the biggest video of my career, and on Saturday, my computer kills itself. I work until Tuesday trying to fix it and recover the footage, and I just end up reformatting it, losing everything. It took me a bit to get everything up and running emotionally, and all my programs and shit installed. Then my computer has more issues, and the following weekend I had to reinstall Windows again, luckily not losing what I had started on for this video. I farted on Monday, and Tuesday through Thursday I worked on this thing. Yell at me on Twitter if I don't upload ever again. K-bye.